All right, guys, so today we are going Funko Pop Avengers Endgame shopping. Oh my goodness, I cannot wait. I want all of them, but I'm not made of money, so I gotta make wise decisions, right? Right, okay. Anyways, so to add to this collection, uh, you, a purple prick. Anyways, he killed off half the universe, little prick, but anyways, um, so the ones I really, really want are the exclusives. Uh, I want the two Walmart exclusives, the Ronin and Hawk and uh, Ronin and Hawkeye. Derp. Anyways, the Ronin and the Rocket Raccoon. I want those two for sure, and I want the Hot Topic Captain America where he's in his throwback like his normal, you know, uniform. He looks lit. He looks G'd up. You know what I'm saying? But um, yeah, those are the three exclusives I really, really want. And then you know, let's see what comments we can pick up. You know, Hawkeye looks lit, so uh, let's see what we can get up, guys. But uh, yeah, just checking in. We're in the end game now, Tony. I can't wait. Let's go. All right, guys, so public service announcement. I know that I, <laughs> you're going to kill me for this, but I recorded them the wrong way. So all the clips from me actually hunting it is going to be vertically. Um, that's my bad. So just perfect public service announcement. Yeah, my bad. Anyways. All right, guys, we are in Think Geek. Come on. Anyways, um, so we found the in-game uh, pops. Tony Stark. Hawkeye. I really like this one. Hawkeye. Close up on him. It was good. Cap. Thanos. Loki. Ant Man. I need to get Ant Man at some point. I need to get Ant Man at some point too. Cause look, doesn't his like suit look really good with him? You know what I'm saying? There's the Funko. Insider Club, Hulk, and then Nebula. Ooh, mom, look at this one. It's a Flarkin. It's Goose the Cat in the Tesseract Glow in the Dark. <laughs> that one is awesome. I really like that one. We got a lot of women from the Shazam, the whole family. Shout out Chris. He picked up one of these. These guys. A quick flare. Do it one time for the camera. Woo! Woo! Okay. Randy Orton, Charlotte Flair, Tista. Really cool pops. Really love the store. I think it. Ooh, this is a good one. I haven't seen this in stores either. Master Chief. Cortana. It's a good pop. Anyways, guys, we're gonna keep looking around. Um, Alright, guys. Hot topic now. In game. Alright, guys, so here's the Avengers section of it. I'm not gonna get War Machine. I'm waiting on the uh, Amazon exclusive. Here's Thor. Tony Stark. That's my girlfriend. There's Hawkeye again. Oh, that's Hulk. Oh, oh, just a normal Hulk. Um, also, they should have an exclusive. Yeah, it's an exclusive War Machine. Pocket Pop. It's kind of cool. Movie moments. Cap. And, uh, yeah. So here's the ending. Let me go over there to the main section and uh, see what they got, guys. All right, guys. So I'm leaving them all now. I know I'm late. I had to work, so I had to get off. But I was by them all. I secured the bag. In-game pops are here. I know I'm late on it. I'm a couple of days late, but we got them. So uh, yeah, no more need to talk. It's the end game now, Tony. Uh, let's get home and uh, review these pops. Yeah. All right, guys. We are at. Walmart. Please have a Ronin. Please have a Ronin. Please have a Ronin. We're a rocket. I really want a rocket. But yeah, we're here. Alright guys. guys, so I came over here to this display. Look at that. Avengers. Let me get this in here. It's a big old like Avengers display over here. Guys, we scored. So we got the Hawkeye that we needed. More importantly, they have the Ronin and the, let me put this down, the Rocket Raccoon. So, so cool guys. Gonna be picking up all three of those today. I am so excited. I can't believe that I found both of them in store. This is so cool, guys. Can't wait to show you those back home. Let's get into these pops. All right, guys. So I'm back here now. I've got all of them. My God, I know I opened this video with saying I, I'm not built of money or whatever, but... Uh, my god, okay, it's Avengers Endgame, all right, whenever are we gonna have a cinematic experience or an event like this ever again, so whatever. I, I copped a lot, okay? I think out of the line, I'm literally just missing two now. 
I'm just missing Black Widow and War Machine. Um, and then the exclusive, two exclusives. But I, I don't want to give anything away. Ah, spoilers. But um, I got a lot, guys. I got probably a lot more than I should have. But uh, yeah, you're not here to hear me ramble. But um, I went to Think Geek first. And they didn't have, well, they had all of them, uh, as you guys saw. But uh, their prices were a little bit, like, uh, too expensive. So then I went to Hot Topic next. And Hot Topic has the three for 27 So I had to get three. And they also have the Hot Topic Captain America that I really wanted. So I caught these three. I will show you the exclusive um, last, I guess. So first up, that was a fail. Thor, son of Odin. Thor, God of Thunder. I picked up Thor, and Infinity War, Thor was uh, one of my favorite characters. We need to be careful with that. Um, Thor was one of my favorite characters, so I was super excited about getting him. This line. Um, but uh, he, super exciting. He's got his Stormbreaker. He's in his quantum suit right there. As you can see, guys, focus in. He's got the uh, Stormbreaker. He's got the cut on his eye. Super, super cool. I don't want you to check out his butt too long. Uh, but anyways, guys, there's Thor right there. He looks really, really good. I really like it. I like how they're rolling with the Stormbreaker. The comics, fun fact, Better Ray Bill wields the Stormbreaker. But that's how the MCU changes up the world, which I really like. It keeps you guessing all the time. But then uh, um, the second one I picked up in the 3 for 27 at Hot Topic was um, the big baddie himself. Let's see, let's try this again. Ooh, that one was really good. Thanos. Bum, bum, bum. Thanos. That's the next one I picked up in the three for 27. And by the way, guys, little life hack. I don't even know if it works or not. I take a little knife and I like to like slide it right in there. Can you see that in there? And then I like to pop it open like that. Just so it kind of just keeps the box a little bit better, you know what I mean? This little tip, and I always go from the bottom just in case if something rips, you know, or like if, you know, sometimes these corners right here rip, it'll be from the bottom instead of the top. I don't know. If you're a collector and you do that, comment down below. Let me know. Or maybe I'm just a weirdo. Maybe I just, I do that and I'm the only one who does that. I don't know. Honestly, I don't know. But um, I think it works. So that's just a little life hack. I've also seen other YouTubers do it, so I don't know. I'm totally bandwagging off of them, but... Anyways, nonetheless, let me shut up. Uh, here is, oh my goodness, look at him. There is Thanos. You gonna, you gonna focus in? You gonna focus in? No, no, no. Okay. Anyways, guys, Thanos, look at the Infinity Gauntlet. Look at him. Boom, look at that sword. Yes, guys, there is Thanos. Set him right there. So where you gonna scoot over a little bit? There's no way I'm gonna be able to fit all of these in here, but uh, we'll leave them on there for you know as long as I can. But yeah, uh, there's a lot. So the last one I picked up, you can probably guess because it's three for twenty-seven at Hot Topic, and I did say I wanted a Hot Topic exclusive. So wow, that one was all right. Boom. Captain America Hot Topic exclusive. And I went back in there the other day because, like I said, guys, I know I'm super duper late on this. The movie's already come out. I've already seen it twice, but um, it's amazing. Go see it, by the way. But I went back and they're all sold out of these. So let me know if your Hot Topics around the world or whoever's watching this has them. Um, and, you know, I went to uh, Dallas this past weekend. Uh, Pop On's going to be coming out soon with my nephews, and we couldn't find uh, any Captain Americas there either. So. And the Hot Topic exclusives, at least. So, that's interesting. So, uh, maybe it's just the Hot Topics that we went in. Maybe they're well-stocked everywhere else. But, uh, I don't know, guys. I don't know. But, nonetheless, I really wanted this Hot Topic exclusive. Just because, you know, going into the movie, everyone knew it was going to be Cap's, like, last ride. And I really, you know, the Quantum suits I actually like. I know a lot of people were hating on them, but... I actually like them. <laughs> I saw a lot of people say they were uh, look like pajamas. <laughs> it's actually kind of funny. But no, they don't look like pajamas. They're cool. But nonetheless, guys, look at that. I wanted it because this is OG uniform. It's Captain America. Look at that. The back. I love that where he straps his, uh, his shield in. That's awesome, guys. That is awesome. 
Captain America, the uh, first Avenger. Boom, guys. All right, we'll, we'll do it this way. We'll, we'll put Thor over here now. Can you see him? Boom. We'll, we'll see how that works out for now. So next, where do I go next? Next, I went to um, GameStop. That was the next day I had to pick up my Ant-Man helmet. If y'all haven't seen the unboxing video, go to my unboxing playlist. And my Ant-Man unboxing is in there. But um, I picked up my Ant-Man helmet and I picked up a couple other pops that were new that I'll be having a pop haul soon. Yeah, guys, I got so many pops that I got to catch you guys up with and get back in the game. But um, I also picked up one more that was in this line. And it is... Wait a second. Wait a second. I can't do this like this. Give me one second, guys. That's more like it. The next one is Ant Man. Okay, but I seriously can't review this with this helmet on. It, it it's gonna screw it. We've already come this far. We just, no, no, okay, well, just give me one second. Sorry, I'm I'm I'm, I'm gonna go take this off now. All right, we're back, guys. Technical difficulties. Anyways, uh, you didn't see that. Um, so Ant Man, beautiful pop. One of my favorite characters. If you know me, you know I love Ant Man. He looks awesome. I think out of the uh, quantum suits or whatever the suits are, um, no, I'm not gonna give away any spoilers. But uh, out of the suits that they give them, you know, that Thor has on there and Ant Man also has on, I think that um, I think Ant Man's suit fits him the best. I mean, it would make sense, you know, but. I'm just going to stop talking because some people haven't seen the movie and might be watching this video. But um, I'm just going to stop talking because I'll get myself in trouble. I don't want to give away any spoilers, but, uh, you know, there he is, Ant-Man, Ant-Man, Ant-Man. He's the Ant-Man. He's the Ant-Man. He's the Ant-Man. He's the Ant-Man. He looks awesome. Nothing on the back. Same thing. Just, just booty bopping. But uh, there's Ant-Man. Can I ask... Sort of the same mold, sort of the same uh, pose that he has for his Ant-Man and the Wasp one. But nonetheless, I love Ant-Man. He's just, his, his mask is so cool, man. He's got the coolest get up. So, you know, had to have it. Had to have it. He's Ant-Man, dude. He, he's so cool. But I'm going to bump you out of here, Thor. I'm going to place Ant-Man right here. And, uh, oops, stay up right there. Also, before I put Thor away, um, no spoilers. But if you haven't seen the movie, I'm not going to say anything that spoils it, but Something on this pop is lying. Majorly. That's all I'm gonna say. Go out and see Endgame, guys. Y'all gotta put a timeline, by the way, on like Endgame, like, you know, before we can do spoilers. But anyways, the next pop, um, my mom actually got me. She ordered it off of Target and surprised me with it. So, you know, I'm glad I didn't pick it up on my hunt because, you know, she got it. But it is the uh, Playboy billionaire philanthropist, Tony Stark. Boom. Look at that in there. I like how they did uh, Tony Stark and then um, the box lunch exclusive. Uh, I did not get because there's no box lunches near me. The closest one is like in downtown Houston by like, <coughs> excuse me, Willowbrook. But, um, you know, I really want the Iron Man box lunch exclusive, which would be super cool to get. But um, I really like how they did Tony Stark for this one. That was an interesting take on that. But uh, I really like it. Uh, I have I have a couple Iron Man pops, so it was kind of cool to get a Tony Stark pop actually for for my collection personally. It's pretty cool. And uh, there he is, Tony Stark, Tony Stank. It's Mr. Tony Stank right there. Ooh, look at him. Look at the look at look at the the beard stash thing he's got going on. Look, we pop again. But yeah, there's Mr. Tony Stark. Can you see Ant Man in there too? Can I get four in here? Can I get four? Let's go for four. Let's go for four. So next, guys, um, I'll save some of the exclusives for last so you, so you guys stick around. But uh, So I went to another Walmart. So I went to one Walmart that y'all saw. I found the, the gold mine of Ronins and Rockets. But before we get to that, I went to another Walmart after that. And I found um, a really, really um, big, big display again. And they had a lot of the ones that I don't have you know and this was my last stop for the day so I, I already picked up a bunch of these and they had a bunch of them that I didn't have starting with one of the gills nebula 
Really, 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 really cool pop. One of the most detailed in this line. I really, really want a Nebula. Uh, I want all the girls. Uh, Nebula, Captain Marvel, Black Widow. I want all of them. But uh, let's see which ones I got. But um, Nebula is super, super detailed. I really like what they did with this pop right here specifically. Um, oh, she comes with a stand. Cool. Cool beans. Set her right there in the middle. Cool beans. Let me get her on the stand real quick. Pop. This pops in right there. Really want to get some good shots of her real quick because, man, she is just detailed to the core. You can't see. She's got all the, you know, machinery like in the movies. And, uh, you know, she's got the, the, the yellowish, orangish uh, spot right here. Super cool. And it goes all the way to our back as well. I'll cover it by you know, decency. But it goes all the way back right here, which is pretty cool. And then it comes up around her eye, just like in the movies. They, they just did a really, really good job of, like, detailing this pop. Really, 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 really detailed pop. So I really like when Funko goes all out on the details on these things. So we'll leave her here for now because it kind of looks cool with all five of them standing right there. Although one of you is going to have to be knocked off the next one because the next one is, um, we'll keep it with another girl. The girl. The best. Oh, man. Uh, I'm just not going to say anything because I can get myself in trouble. Uh, just no comment. Just no. Boom. No comment. You don't need to say anything. It's Captain Marvel. Of course. I had to get Carol Danvers. I have the Target Con one. That's one of my favorite pops in my entire collection. And this one was, like, vastly different enough because the Target Con one I have, uh, she has a mohawk. So this one is vastly different enough with her hair down. And also, you know, she has her, like, hands like this. She's super cool. So this one was, uh, oh, also comes with a stand. Cool deal. It was different enough where I had to get it. And plus, it's just, it's just another Carol Danvers pop. Like, it's Captain Marvel, dude. Like, why wouldn't you want it? But super cool Funko Pop. Super excited that I found this one, and Ant-Man, we gotta go. We're gonna knock Ant-Man off of here. We're also gonna knock Tony Stank off of here. And we are going to put Captain Marvel on her stand. Pop. And boom, guys, there you go. Oops, okay. There we go. There she is, coming at you, light speed, just like that. Nothing much in the back. No, no, we're not going to do that. We're not going to do that. Okay. So anyways, um, there she is, guys. She looks awesome. It's just another Captain Marvel pop. I want to collect all the Captain Marvel pops. She's one of my favorite characters. Aid on me in the comments if you want. I don't care. But uh, yeah, super cool. I think both the girls look cool. I think Black Widow looks really, really cool. They did a good job with her, too. But uh, yeah, another super cool Funko pop. And the last one I got at that Walmart is... Big boy, the Incredible Hulk. Now this one, <laughs> this one will make a whole lot more sense whenever you see the movie. It's not a spoiler. Man, y'all just need to go see the movie so we can talk about it. But um, Whenever you see the movie, you'll appreciate the pop more. I'll just say that. I'll just say that. That's not a spoiler, is it? I don't think it's a spoiler. But, uh, they did a really, really good job capturing... Um, I'll show you after I show you the, the, the wide shot of him, but there he is. Um, the Incredible Hulk. He's got his quantum suit on. Also, notice, uh, I don't know if you noticed, but see that little like blue thing right there on their arm? Uh, it's pivotal to the movie's plot, but also, I don't know if you can get it on camera. If the camera will like zoom it, stop shaking your head. Oh. But uh, that little piece right there is like really gray, like Mar Mark Ruffalo's hair. So that's just a really good touch to uh, the Hulk on this pop, which is which is really cool. <laughs> so again, um, good details on that, but uh, and just how much bigger, like look size comparison to Captain Marvel. So I, I really like the Hulk. So yeah, the last stop, or that that was the last stop. But before there was the last little haul that we got was these three two exclusives is the video you saw we went to Walmart and uh, we found the gold mine of the exclusives so um, before we show you the exclusives this would be a great segue I think this is probably it doesn't matter if it's an exclusive or a like common or whatever Hawkeye this is my favorite 
pop out of the line is Hawkeye. So it doesn't matter if, uh, you know, it's the Walgreens exclusive, it's this common version, it's the uh, Walmart exclusive, it, whatever, dude. The Hawkeye pops they made are so awesome. They are my favorite pops in this line. And I like all of them, really. I mean, that's why I bought them. But um, the Hawkeye pops are just so, so cool. They are so, so cool. Man, I have a lot of boxes in my room, too. But uh, they're so, so cool. I mean, the hair, too. Say what you want about it in the trailer. But on a toy, on a Funko Pop... The, the hair looks so cool, man. It looks so cool. We're just going to hold them like this. Okay. Yeah, so. And then just get a good little shot of his hair there. Don't get my face in it. But yeah, he's got shaved off on the side. He's got his bow and arrow right here, ready to go. I like how he's got the, the two uh, two or three fingers, you know, black on here. Just, just the detail. He's got on his back, he's got, you know, where his bows go. Uh, just super super cool and you know uh, like I said the Walgreens one looks cool with the, uh, the the quantum suits like Nebula right here has on but I really like this one as well because he's got that uh, that gold and black look to it so yeah Hawkeye definitely definitely looks super super cool uh, man and on a toy the hair looks freaking awesome and the movie didn't look bad either honestly I think people were overreacting but uh yeah, this this is one of my favorite pops. Common or not, it doesn't matter. Ooh, we're gonna knock out. We're gonna knock out the two big boys this time. Thanos and Hulk. Y'all can fight it out like y'all did in Infinity War. I don't care. Ugh. And you know what? We got a couple more to go, so maybe like, you can get knocked out. Ugh. Captain Marvel, get close to Steve. We'll put Hawkeye right there next to you, and we'll keep it moving. So going off Hawkeye. Like I said, th these are my favorite pops out of the line, is the Ronin, the Walmart exclusive Ronin. This one, I didn't know if I was gonna be able to get my hands on this one. We found them in Walmarts. I actually found them while I was in Dallas in some more Walmarts, so I don't know, guys. If you're looking for some, they still might be in stores, guys, so keep looking, keep, keep searching around. They still might be in stores. Don't give up, because I've been seeing a lot of the Rockets and a lot of the Ronins and a bunch of Walmarts uh, in Dallas and here, you know, some of the bigger Walmarts are in like downtown Houston and stuff, you know. So keep looking. Uh, they they've been pretty easy to find, but I don't know how long they'll last because this is this thing is whoo. They knocked this one out of the park. This was a home run for me personally. I think Ronin is the coolest one out of the entire series. He's got his uh, sword holster back there. Again, he's in his gold and black uniform. He's holding his blade, his sword. And, of course, he is Ronin, so he's got his hood up, man. He's got his face covered. He looks so cool. He just, I mean, look look at this. Hold on. Let me put these side by side. Check that, check that out, man. Check that out, man. That's just ridiculous. That's just so cool. But yeah, the, the the Hawkeyes, I think they just absolutely killed it. Uh, Funko did with these. The last but not least, is the last exclusive we found is another Walmart exclusive, the Rocket Raccoon. The Rocket Raccoon is really cool. He's in his quantum suit as well. Rocket is just one of my favorite characters. So um, I think Walmart knew that. They were like, you know, hey, Mr. Chase Hall guy, he. Uh, he really likes rockets, so let's just make it exclusive and make it super hard on him to get one of his favorite characters. Yeah, that's what Walmart did. But, um, no. Uh, it, like I said, I've been seeing these a lot in stores lately, so if you can't find them, um, go around to two or three different Walmarts. I bet you can find them. Uh, look for the big displays. But, uh, nonetheless, man, and I like how uh, he's super, super small before I show you. Look at the size comparison. But uh, here is Rocket Raccoon. Funko Pop Walmart exclusive. Show you the backside just to show you his little tail right there. He looks super cool. Rocket Raccoon in his quantum suit. And of course, he's got guns because he's Rocket Raccoon. So there is the entire line. Man, my floor is destroyed now, but it was worth it because I got to show all of you guys all of the Avengers Endgame Funko Pops I got. And I know I was super duper, super uber duper late on this, but I got it to you guys. And this is going to come out after the movie is going to come out. <laughs> it's going to come out days and days after the movie. But 
oh well guys, better late than never, right? That's That was my motto for this, so, uh, you know. And there's still a couple that I need. Like I said, I need War Machine, uh, both the normal and the Amazon exclusive. I need this feller, Hawkeye, and the Walgreens exclusive. Um, see, I need Black Widow for sure. Uh, you know, she'll probably be the easiest to get, her and War Machine, but I need two exclusives. The Amazon exclusive War Machine and the uh, Walgreens exclusive Hawkeye. So if I can nail those, those would be awesome. And I would have like the whole set. Oh, and the box lunch Iron Man, but that's just difficult for me because I have to order it online and pay for shipping and all that. Eh, eh, whatever. But, um, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens. But nonetheless, I got all of these pops i'm super super grateful that you know all the walmarts had you know the ones that i wanted and the hot topic etc and they had all these good boxes and stuff so shout out to all those stores and uh, all the people that were cool with me recording and stuff like that but uh yeah guys if you like this video leave a like if you want to see more videos from me subscribe to see more videos in the future comment down below what pops did you get what are your favorite pops from the line i like all the hawkeyes the walgreens the normal the ronin all of them hawkeyes are so lit but uh, let me know if you already seen Endgame. What's your favorite moment from Endgame? But please, please, in the comments, the Russo brothers have said it. Marvel Studios said it. Don't spoil Endgame. I'm giving them a week, though. I'm giving them a week. And then I'm talking about Endgame on everything. But anyways, guys, if you like this video, leave a like, subscribe, comment. And uh, until next time, guys, I'm out.